The Recovery of Columbia's Crew, A Tragic Timeline Hello everyone. Today we're delving into a tragic yet important piece of space exploration history. We're going to discuss the Space Shuttle Columbia disaster, specifically focusing on the recovery of the brave crew members who lost their lives in the line of duty. This is a serious and sensitive topic, and it is discussed with the utmost respect for the astronauts and their families. What happened to Columbia? The Space Shuttle Columbia disintegrated upon re-entering Earth's atmosphere on February 1, 2003. All seven crew members on board tragically lost their lives. This event marked a critical point in space exploration, leading to significant improvements in safety protocols. The Recovery Process After the disintegration of Columbia, an extensive search and recovery operation was set in motion. It took about two months, from February to April 2003, to recover the remains of the crew members. This operation was a collaborative effort, involving thousands of personnel from local, state, and federal agencies. The Significance of the Recovery The recovery of the Columbia crew was not just about bringing closure to the families and the space community, but also about understanding what went wrong. The data collected during the recovery process played a significant role in the subsequent investigation into the accident. This has, in turn, led to significant advancements in spacecraft design and safety procedures. The loss of the Columbia crew was a tragic event that deeply impacted the global community. The recovery of their remains, while a painful process, played a crucial role in improving the safety of future space missions. As we remember these brave astronauts, we also acknowledge their contribution to space exploration. Their sacrifice has led to important advancements in space safety, ensuring that their legacy continues to make a difference in space exploration.